Welcome back, everyone. It's Celebrity Chef Week here on Valley View Live. We are pleased to have Executive Chef Christina Wilson from Gordon Ramsay Burger here today. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, thanks for having me. It smells Christina. delicious. Oh, it does. Yeah. I wish yeah. everyone just got done. What is the secret to making the best burgers? <sighs> making the best burger. I think a lot of times you just have to keep it simple. Um, for us, we use a really nice blend of, of meat. We use the chuck, the short rib, and the brisket. Okay. And our beef patty, um, it gives it... It's so a little more moisture. We also cook over an open flame, which not a lot of people in Vegas do. Actually, not really anywhere. But um, for the volume we do to be co cooking over an open wood flame is, it's a lot of work. It's very tedious, but it definitely makes a difference in the, you'll see in the flavor of the burger. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. And so um, what is your signature burger? Our signature burger, um, and I'll base that on our highest selling, would be the Hell's Kitchen burger. Uh -huh. So it's our, our beef patty that I just talked about a little bit. It's topped with asadero cheese, roasted jalapeno, roasted tomato, and avocado. Ooh. We sell about 10,000 of those a month. Wow. wow. Um, and are the burgers a la carte, so everything comes a la carte? Yeah, uh, and you'll see on your menus, you know, we have our... Here we go. Um, <laughs> we have a handful oh, of menus. ones that are already composed for you. Here's uh -huh. Ramsey. And then uh, always, yes. Gordon He's always watching. And Here's the French fries? <laughs> French fries How hand delicious. Cut. They're so good. Thin or ah. thin? Or Pain thick. to make, but thick. Big, <laughs> big steak cut fries. <laughs> um, but definitely worth it. You're yeah, building right. a burger for us right we now. Are. What and are you this making? is actually um, the one burger that you won't find on oh, the menu. Oh, okay. Um, it's our, our secret burger. You have to know about it to ask for you it. You do. Okay. It's you one do. of those. Okay. We like to put our trust in our servers, too, to, to kind of give you a heads up about it if you're not a regular um, at our establishment. But it's, we call it the Gordon Burger. Okay. We feature our Mangalista uh, pork patty, and it has an English sharp cheddar, fresh avocado, a Fresno mm -hmm. pepper relish, Ooh. bib lettuce, and I'm finishing up the duck bacon right now. That'll be um, on there as well. And yeah. while you're wow. making that, you already made us some. Uh, I did. Some I know because every there. every morning she starts with the milkshake. Oh, salute! Ooh. That's our um, yes. our Oreo shake. Mm. It's topped with creme brulee pudding. Okay. Mm. And uh, a little bit of whipped cream. Wow, that's fantastic. Oh yeah, you, I think uh, that's it's kind of a mm. classic combination mm -hmm. shakes and shakes and burgers, right? With now, how do you chunks? like your burgers? Rare, medium rare? Yeah, about mid rare. Mm -hmm. like, yeah, same as same as my steaks. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, medium rare for me. When people you come to your restaurant, are yes. they surprised at just, I mean, you think hamburgers and you think burgers, and then you guys have taken it to a whole new level. Yeah, which is pretty standard for Chef. Yeah. He, um, he does that. You know, you, you can't really reinvent the wheel, but you can certainly make it sexier, which is what we do at, at Burger. Right. A lot of, a uh, handful of classics, um, your blue cheese burger and... Um, the American burger, but then we'll put a twist on our on our cheeseburger. Rather than just using American, we use some different imported cheeses. Um, same thing with things like the Gordon burger, our Mongolista hog patty. Um, yeah, we get we're, we're lucky. We get to play a lot, and mm -hmm, yeah. about two or three Saturdays a month, we get with the food and beverage team at Planet Hollywood and work on new new burger sets. Um, because you, I mean, you ladies are familiar with Vegas and, and customers <laughs> aren't shy to tell you what they want. No. Right. Or um, so we, they're health conscious or vegetarians yes. yeah. or gluten free. Like what do you gluten do? Gluten free accommodate? that took us a minute to, to get used to, but what we do because we have this really delicious brioche roll, which you'll you'll enjoy in a few minutes, um, we'll put it in a lettuce wrap. So if you see our um, bib lettuce, we just take the outer layers of that and use that instead of a bun for our people that have um, celiacs or a, a gluten allergy. Uh, we also have non bread for some people that can't have seeds. Um, most allergies we are able to accommodate fairly easily. Um, even people that don't eat beef or pork, <laughs> we're able to throw in a fried egg or two. And you know, well, tell us about the world of being an executive chef because for a long time it was a very male dominated <laughs> and still is. Exactly. And now we're seeing more and more women like yourself and young we women are, yeah, getting involved. It's really, um, it's really remarkable because even when I started out young in my career, there were very few. I mean, Julia Child will always Everybody, be yeah, kind of the, the queen of culinary for, for us. Um, but yeah, there are very few, um, especially, I mean, Gordon's pushing a, being a billion dollar brand. So there's very few chefs that have that many Michelin stars that, that far up, um, up the ladder that are appointing female executive chefs. I'm lucky to be with a company that does it quite often. Um, chef has, I want to say, five right now executive chefs between wow, that's a lot. me and the States and yeah. um, over in the UK. I know Kim Woodward's at York and Albany. Um, I think he has two other ones at Head and Street and Bread Street, perhaps. Wow. Um, 
but yeah, he's you know he he's fair. It's, yeah. You wouldn't necessarily think because of how much he yells, but he is he is very fair. <laughs> he's actually a softie. I've seen yeah. other shows. Yes. I love him. Yeah. He, he now we're almost uh, out of time. Can yeah. you plate something for us? Absolutely. So Finishing look? the bacon now, and uh, mm -hmm. you ladies will get about to a minute left. Get Do you to try see the yourself? hosting a reality show that involves cooking one day? Do I see myself yeah. doing it? I would do it with kids. Um, oh. I'm really a sucker for kids. Um, or if it was based around, as I'm putting bacon on your burger, based around <laughs> healthy right. eating, really healthy. Um, I think it would, that would be something I would be interested in. But um, believe it or not, I've, uh, Hell's Kitchen satisfied a lot of <laughs> the TV aspect for me, I'm pretty, I'm pretty <laughs> okay with this. But the you know. kids, that's awesome. Ten and it's higher. nice to end on a high note, so right. to win the show and then um, be able to go on and be successful within his company. And not just under be Caesars. at one restaurant of his, yeah. you had the opportunity to do two restaurants with him. Which now. is, yeah, I mean, I, and trust me, I have, my family will tell you, I've worked my, worked my butt off to get there. Yeah. But a lot of lot sacrifice, of hours and, sure. But it's oh, worth yeah. it, I mean. Well, and what I love about your burgers, too, is they're not like burgers. They're like sort of like skyscrapers. Right? <laughs> yeah. They're so amazing. amazing. They are seriously we need stacked. Right. It's good, oh right? Oh, my Ooh. gosh. This is beautiful. Well, you can Goodness. taste the gourmet creations of Chef Christina Wilson at Gordon Ramsay Burger, located inside Planet Hollywood on the Las Vegas Strip. For more information, check out the website. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> or the number on your screen. Now, still to come on.